Hello everyone. Welcome to Stress Relief Zone. Today's Bible reading is The Holy Spirit empowers you to be productive and fruitful. Before I start, let us pray. Dear Heavenly Father, I thank you for your expression of your word that gives me the right information to think and meditate upon. Your word continually finds its home in my heart. Your word in my life shows me how to walk on the paths of victory, prosperity, and success. My spirit, soul, and body are under the dominion of your word. As I listen to your word, let it transform my mind. In Jesus' name, Amen. The Bible says in Isaiah 32, 15, King James Version. Until the Spirit be poured upon us from on high, and the wilderness be a fruitful field, and the fruitful field be counted for a forest. In other words, once more, God will send us His Spirit. The wastelands will become fertile, and fields will produce rich crops. When the Holy Spirit comes into your life as a Christian, one of the most wonderful evidences of his presence and influence is that you become more fruitful and productive. He comes in with an anointing that has an impact on your life and makes things work. Things may go wrong and your life becomes a wilderness. But only until the Holy Spirit is poured out on you from above. Your life is transformed. The presence of God is associated with the anointing of God's Spirit. Until the Spirit be poured upon us from on high. The prophet Isaiah said in Isaiah 32, 15, he meant until the anointing comes upon us. We, 
on the other hand, aren't waiting for the anointing to fall on us. The Holy Spirit has been poured out on you from on high if you have received the Holy Spirit of God. As a result, there is no need to struggle in order to be successful, fruitful, or productive. When you examine your life, you may notice that there is a great deal of inefficiency. Your home appears to be a desert. Your finances may be in shambles and your health may be failing by the day. Water will rise up from your desert if you have the Holy Spirit. In every aspect of your life, you will be more productive and grow. As you progress forward, a bursting fault will occur on both your right and left hands. But I'm not dry and my life isn't unproductive. You might say, thank God for you, but there is a better option. Your productive field can be transformed into a forest. This implies you can be more spiritually and financially productive. Your life has the potential to impact more people for Jesus. You can progress from miraculous healing to divine health. Glory to God there is always something better for you in Christ. The Bible says in John 15, 5, King James Version, I am the vine, ye are the branches. He that abideth in me and I in him, the same bringeth forth much fruit, for without me ye can do nothing. In other words, if you want to grow spiritually, financially, live in divine health, and make progress day by day, you have to remain or abide in Jesus Christ. If you separate from Christ and you cut all communication with Him, you will accomplish nothing. The Bible says in John 15, 16, King James Version. 
ye have not chosen me, but I have chosen you and ordained you that ye should go and bring forth fruit and that your fruit should remain that whatsoever ye shall ask of the father in my name he may give it you in other words if you are a christian you are chosen by the lord and appointed to win souls for jesus and those souls should remain in the Lord so that whatever you ask of the Father in Jesus name he may give to you the Bible says in Colossians 1 10 King James Version. That ye might walk worthy of the Lord unto all pleasing, being fruitful in every good work and increasing in the knowledge of God. For this is the desire of the Lord, that ye may walk in all pleasing ways, bearing souls in all good works, and increase in the knowledge of God. Say this prayer with me. Dear Heavenly Father, I thank you for endowing me with all spiritual blessings in heavenly places in Christ Jesus. I'm full and loaded with good things. And I bring forth excellence from within me. I'm prospering and making progress on all sides. Because you have ordained me to an excellent life of fruitfulness and productivity in Jesus' name. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the communion of the Holy Ghost be with you all. Amen. I hope you have been blessed with these Bible scriptures. Please continue 
to meditate on these scriptures daily. It will get into your spirit and you will start getting results to live a victorious life. I encourage you to be a part of this channel. Like, comment, and share this video with your friends and family. Subscribe and turn notification bell on. Also, check other videos on this channel. Thank you for watching. God bless you.